Same as last week. I'll tell you exactly where it's at. And I could have said this earlier in the year, but it's an excuse. You know, like seven tries out of the day. <clears throat> you know, you get four origin play, um, two origin players score four of them. You get an international score another one. And you get two internationals in the halves who had an outstanding game. They're great players, Benji and Young Will. I've got a devastated bunch of boys in there who are busting their gut at the moment. All season they have. Even when we get beaten by 50, they've been putting in. And it hurts me to see them hurt. It really does. <coughs> it kills me to see them upset. Losing two star players last year, losing two origin players last year, they put us into this run. We win games this year with those two players here. We're in a position now where we've got to rebuild. <coughs> now every fan, every supporter, they can jam it into us and they can bag us for what it is. But until I get origin players or internationals here, around that group of blokes in there, who I've got some brilliant young players coming through, it ain't gonna change. So that's my job. It's as simple as that. And they've got to cut to the chase and just be fair to come up front, and that's where we're at. Until I can recruit those boys, and until we recruit our own, uh, sorry, grow our own, um, they used to get up to stick solid and, and keep working hard to try and get a win for this club. It's a great club, it's, a, it, it's got a very proud history, and we're all hurt very much in the moment in regards to losing. But I won't take my eye off the job. And that was why I'm making that statement today in regards to what we're going to do to build this club. You're only going to see out there, you're only going to see last week. <clears throat> One player beat us last week, a superstar. Today, international players and origin players beat us. We haven't got any. Until I get it here, we're going to have to keep fighting hard. How do you go around those guys in the club? Do you need help from the NRL? Or? No, we've just got to, um, we've got to persevere. I've said all year, it's time and patience. Now, if you want me to be more open and honest about it, which I don't like doing because it just gives all the knockers out there and even crack at me, um, so if you it doesn't hurt me, I don't give a start about what people say about me. I'm here to do a job. The way I do it is, we've just got to slowly, slowly build. And I'll grow my own in there. I've got origin players in there that one day will play origin. I've got kids in there that are absolutely hurting and killing themselves at the moment in regards to not being able to win. It is not effort, it is not work of training, it is not commitment. They love this club as much as I do and their fans do. I will, I will gradually get our own and I will gradually recruit players to this club and we will be a force again one day. That's why I keep saying it's time and patience. Is there anything in particular record that's made you say this to yeah, I'm getting sick of it. I'm just getting fed up with probably just giving you the old one-liner, Josh, to make it all sound as though I'm not, not looking for um, a scapegoat or I'm not trying to make excuses. I'm not trying to make excuses. I'm just telling you exactly how anybody who knows the game, anybody who sees us playing, knows we're busting our boil and trying to do well. Anybody who knows the game, they know the position we're in and what I, what I need to do for the club. I'm not, I'm not making excuses, I'm not that type of person. Talk about representing players with guys like Papali and, and Paul Vaughan showed that those are the sort of guys that will be the best players. Yeah, well Josh, Josh has had a tough year all year. He's had a hangover from the World Cup all year. He's a young boy and he knows himself he needs a rest. He even said that himself. Um, he, um, he's our only representative player and we can't leave it all hanging on him. We've got young boys coming through there and young Jack and Toots, Vaughan. They're young players of the future who I think can represent. We've got to build around those boys with the other players we've got. It's not, it, it is not um, criticising the young blokes I've got there playing um, in my group. It's a, um, they're, they're a fabulous young blokes, a group of blokes to work with. I've enjoyed